All right, boys, so as you may have heard earlier today, the rock world lost Christine McVie. Christine Perfect McVie was her name, passed away today at the age of 79 years old. And this is one of the great voices in the history of rock and roll, even though she did not get as much credit as she deserved. She was overshadowed by some other band members. She went all the way back to the Peter Green era. She went all the way through. She covered the entire era, aside from her mini retirement in the early 2000s. She eventually came back and rejoined the band, not for an album, but for subsequent tours. And th she was my favorite voice she was my favorite female voice in that band and probably the best voice period in the history of that band and one that is recognizable. There's some voices that are just instantly you know who it is and she was one of those. For those who know, you know, rock and roll uh, singers. So this is her 1984 solo album. I believe some of her bandmates had a little part, some credits in this. It was uh, you know, self-titled. It had a minor hit called Got a Hold on Me, which was pretty good. I might have to listen to this tonight. In fact, I think that Buckingham wrote one of the songs on this, but I'm not entirely sure about that, but she was a wonderful piano player and songwriter along with being a, a very not great singer some of the songs she did she wrote a lot of the hits for the band but also a lot of wonderful songs that did not do anything on the chart so you can go back to the Kerwin Welch era uh, show me a smile Sm uh, spare me a little of your love dissatisfied remember me from Penguin, one of my favorites. Uh, Come a little bit closer. Prove your love from Heroes Are Hard to Find is a great song. Over My Head, Say You Love Me. And of course, You Make Loving Fun and Songbird. And then into the 80s, songs like Hold Me and uh, Wish You Were Here. Even The Sky's the Limit from 1990. The uh, One of the albums without, I think that was the album without Knicks or Buckingham. So just a a great style in her writing, that kind of storytelling style to it. And then her voice solo was, was great to listen to. Uh, the songs were always so pleasant. She brought a real kind of a calming spirit and a soul type of spirit also to a a band with a tumultuous history. So just that California rock mixed with British blues was part of her singing style, which made it wonderful, but also the harmonies that she had, not only with just with Nicks, but also with Nicks and Buckingham together. Those three, um, I think one person put it, were just meant to meant to sing together as well as her harmonies with uh with danny Kerwin and bob welch and that era was also a great thing to listen to so what does this mean for the history of or the future of the band fleetwood mac for anyone who's wondering about that because they this People have been wondering, is there going to be a reunion where they have one more tour together? I think the last one was maybe around 2014, somewhere in there. And then uh, Buckingham was kind of forced out around 20, I want to say 2018 or 2019. And they brought in uh, Neil Finn from Crowded House as well as Campbell from from Tom Petty and the Heartbreakers. It's kind of a weird thing for their tour, so it's kind of a strange mix, but 
So who knows? Like there's there's from from what I've heard, there was a irreparable differences where they would never were the the five from the rumors on uh, lineup would never get back together. But perhaps now with Christine McVie uh, sadly passing away at the age of 79, perhaps this will give the four remaining members that sense of, you know, things are, uh, life is fleeting and maybe they will get back together for one more tour and they will be able to patch things up. So I've never seen them live before or any of the solo artists like Buckingham before, but I know Bolt Dog saw them on maybe what was their last good tour. I think around 2013 he saw them. So, uh, so stay tuned. Who knows what will happen. But, uh, for, but today, a sad day in rock and roll. Rest in peace. Christine Perfect McVie, gone at 79. She will be missed. I have to play some of the music tonight in her memory. All right, guys. Have a good evening.